bossy. He's my dad. He's retired now, and he sort of turned over the keys of the business to me. Pass the baton. Carry on the legacy. Yeah, he is well loved and respected. Kind of like these employees and other sales team. Continue to give me that love and that Pope-like reverence and respect to me. Who did that? Who did that? Very funny, guys. Very funny. Yeah, respect comes in many forms. That's their own personal way of reverence. I'm well revered. Reverenced. Reverbed. Reverbed. It's like Aretha said. R-E-S-P-E-C-T. Da-da-da-da something to me. Okay, gather up. Bring it in. Bring it on in, everyone. You too, Marianne. Why do I have to join the meeting up? I'm not part of sales. Because you're part of the team. This is a team effort. Team meeting. Can't spell team without E, and E is one half of the word we. Come on, let's go, chop chop. Okay, guys, it's Monday, it's the first day of the week. Woohoo! I thought Sunday was the first day of the week. Work week, Jamal, work week. But this week's gonna be different. Does anyone know why? Anyone? Yeah, let's see. You're going to be quiet and not say a word all week and actually do some work instead. Um, uh, no. I don't know what you're talking about, Rick. I don't talk much. And when I do, I make a strong point. And I'm always working. This guy, I'm constantly working. Okay, can we edit that part out? No? Rick's a real ball buster. Lucky for me, I'm Teflon. Nothing sticks to me or affects me. Balls of steel. Balls of steel. Anyways, Rick, with the snide, inappropriate comments, today we're going to talk about team spirit. Team unity. I've been reading some books by Napoleon Hill, Tony Robbins, and my personal favorite, one by Zig Ziglar, called... Success for Dummies. Wow, now that's an appropriate title for you. I'm not a dummy. And I don't think you guys are dummies. But this Zig Ziglar was a salesman out of Texas. And he was able to sell just about anything. And he said, team unity increases team morale. And team morale translates into sales. And that's what we're all about. Sales, sales, sales. Someone give me an S. Give me an A. Come on, guys, give me L-E-S. What does it spell? It is often that my team is unmotivated. I like to give them a pep talk, just to rev them up and get them going. What does it spell, Marsha? Sales? It spells sales. Sales, I'm with you, Matt. I feel you, bro. Why, thank you, Rob. At least somebody has energy around here today. Good day of work, everybody. You did well. True team spirit. Take it easy, Jamal. Okay, then. See you guys tomorrow. Since no one made a sale today, we'll just extend the prize to tomorrow. Or better yet, to the end of the week. That was the plan all along, wasn't it? I bust my ass for nothing. Being a salesman's a hard job. It's not easy work. But after a hard day's work... If there's one thing that consoles me, if nothing else, at the end of the day, with all our quirks and shortcomings, 